Hello guys, today we are going to discuss about a booth multiplier recording. A booth multiplier recording is a technique used in booth multiplication when the multiplier is a negative signed number. Where booth multiplication means it is a method used to multiply the signed binary numbers. Let us take one example to understand this concept very clearly. Suppose if the given two numbers are plus 12 is multiplying with minus 2. The first number we called it as multiplicand. The second number is a multiplier indicated with a small m. Now, to apply the booth multiplication method to multiply these signed numbers, first we have to convert in terms of binary. To convert these signed numbers into binary, we should assign the sign bit for positive sign and negative sign. For positive sign, the sign bit value is 0. For negative sign, the sign bit value is 1. And also, one more point is, whenever we have the negative signed number, negative signed numbers should be specified in two's complement only. Now, let us write the Boolean. Now, let us write the equivalent binary values. Plus 12, the equivalent binary is plus means 0. 12 means, depending on the four binary weights, 1, 2, 4, 8, 1, 1, 0, 0. This is the equivalent binary for plus 12. Similarly, minus 2. Minus 2 means minus is sine weight value is 1. Usually, to represent 2 in binary, 2 bits are sufficient depending on the binary weights. But here in booth multiplication, we are going to perform the multiplication with the help of the 2's complement. That's why we have to take both multiplier and multiplication, both multiplicand and multiplier with the same number of bits. That's why we have to place the two more zeros in the left position. Now it is 0, 0, 1, 0. But this is not the complete binary. As minus 2 is a negative signed number, always the magnitude should be written in 2's complement form only. Now, we don't change the sign bit value as it is. It should be taken. Now, the remaining bits are 2's complemented. 0, 1, until the first one, no change. The remaining 2 bits should be flipped. This is the equivalent binary form for minus 2 in 2's complement form. Okay, now to multiply plus 12 with minus 2, we should rewrite the given numbers in binary form as 0, 1, 1, 0, 0 into 1, 0, 0, 1, 0. This is the multiplicand. This is the multiplier. These are the multiplicand bits. These are the multiplier bits. Now here, the multiplier is a negative signed to complement number we have to modify this multiplier value with the help of the booth multiplier recording. To convert this multiplier, here we have to see this table. This is the booth multiplier recording table. Here, this is the multiplier. The second column represents the version of multiplicand selected by bit i. That means if the bit changes from i minus 1 to i, that means suppose if it is i minus 1 and this is i, Okay, this is the position of the bits. Then 0 to 1, 0 to 0. 0 to 0 means 0 minus 0. It should be equal to 0. Okay, that's why the multiplicand, it is selected. The multiplicand should be multiplied with the value of a 0 when the multiplier bits changes from 0 to 0. Similarly, if, if the bits are changing from 1 to 0, the difference is 1 minus 0 is 1. That means plus 1. Is, that means multiplication is multiplied with the plus 1. Now, 0 minus 1. Its equivalent value is minus 1. So that the multiplicand is multiplied with the value of the minus 1. Now, it should be 1 and 1. That means 1 minus 1 is equal to 0. So that the multiplicand is multiplied with the 0. So this is the booth multiplier recording table. Based on this table, we should convert this multiplier value into recorded value as here it is 1, 0, 0, 1, 0. Now to convert this multiplier, bend 0 towards LSP position. This is insert a 0, extra bit 0 towards the right side position. Now we should start the process of the both multiplier recording. 0 minus 0 is its equivalent value is 0. We should write the under the 0. 
now 0 minus 1 0 minus 1 means the subtraction is minus 1 so that it should be written as minus 1 1 minus 0 is 1 so that it should be positive plus 1 0 minus 0 is 0 0 minus 1 is minus 1 okay these are the new multiplier bits to multiply the applicant now this is the way of finding the both multiplier recording for the given multiplier negative signed number. Let us take another example. Suppose if we multiply the plus 14 into minus 4. These are the given numbers. Plus 14 means this is 0. 14 means 1, 2, 4, 8. So that 1, 1, 1, 0. This is the binary, equivalent binary. Next, minus 4. Minus 4 means sign bit is 1. 4 means with the help of the 4 bits we should write. Okay. Now, 1, 0, 0 is the equivalent to 4. Now, we should place the 0 here. But it is a negative signed number. So, that we should write the this negative signed number in 2's complemented form. Now, 1, we don't change the sign bit value. Only we should write the remaining magnitude in 2's complement form. So, that first 0, 0, 1 as it is until the first one is same. The remaining bits should be flipped or complemented. That means 1. This is the 2's complemented value of the multiplier. Now, we should write the given numbers in binary form as 0, 1, 1, 1, 0 is multiplying with minus 4. Minus 4 means this is the equivalent value. 1, 1, 1, 0, 0. Okay, this is called as multiplicand is indicated with the capital M letter. This is the multiplier should be indicated with the small m letter. Now, as the multiplier is a negative signed number, we have multiplier with the help of the both multiplier recording. Now, let us rewrite the multiplier. Okay. The multiplier bits are 1, 1, 1, 0, 0. Now, we should append the 0 here towards right side position, LSB. Now, between 0 to 0, what is the difference? 0. So, that the 0 should be written under the 0. Now, again 0, 0. The difference is 0. 0 minus 1 is minus 1. So, that we should write minus 1 here. 1 minus 1 is 0. Okay, this is 0. 1 minus 1 again 0. So, that its value is 0. So, these are the new bits in multiplier to multiply the multiplicand to perform the multiplication operation with the help of the both multiplication. This is about both multiplier recording. Now, you can see the explanation about this both multiplier recording table also. Here, in general, in the both algorithm, minus 1 times the shifted multiplicand is selected when moving from 0 to 1. Okay, 0 to 1 means we have to shift the value in minus 1 times. That is, multiplicand is multiplied with minus 1. Now, and plus 1 times the shifted multiplicand is selected when moving from 1 to 0. 1 to 0 means its equivalent value is 1. Difference is 1. As the multiplier is scanned from right to left. Now, if it is 0 to 0, then there is no change. That means it is equivalent to 0. Similarly, 1 minus 1 means its difference is 0. So, that the same magnitude value. So, that the multiplicand is multiplied with 0 in both cases of 0, 0 and 1, 1. This is about both the multiplier recording. Now, in the next video, we will see how to multiply different signed binary numbers with the help of the both multiplication along with this both multiplier recording if the multipliers are having negative signed numbers. Hope you understand this topic very clearly. Thank you.